Welcome to Cellmap Machinery Knowledge Base. I'm here to show you today how to set the stroke switches, or we call limit switches, on our Morgan Rushworth steel workers. We're looking at a 70 ton steel worker, 70 ton and up, have two, two rams, so they have two lots of switches. Your lower switch is to set your depth stop, and your top switch is to set your return stroke. These may be adjusted in time to speed up production so you're not working on full return stroke. This is your stroke adjustment on your punch side and this is your stroke adjustment on your shearing side. Your stroke adjustment on your 45 and 60 ton machines is in a different position to the 70 machine. It's under the bed. It's a one ram machine so it only has one adjustment for the complete machine. This is your lower end adjustment and this is your return adjustment. It's very very important that your adjustment handle bolts are done up tight. If these are loose and the machine is in motion, these could slip and when your cylinder returns, it could go beyond the limit switch point, so in theory, your cylinder could bottom out. I've opened up the front of the steel worker so you can see the limit switches behind. As you can see, you have your lower stop and your top stop with the two blue limit switches behind. Your lower blue limit switch for your lower stroke and your top blue limit switch for your return stroke. In the situation where these can slip, the machine will start making a very loud noise because the cylinder has bottomed out. In this situation, you need to turn the machine off and come back and readjust your limit switches to the normal position. 